Hello, elites, and welcome back to Minecraft Elite vs. Wild. This is episode 121. That is the bus I take to downtown sometimes. Well, anyways, um, here we are, and we are in a section that you probably have never seen in a long time. So, a long time ago, I built a um, cemetery slash graveyard or whatever for real life people that I hate. Yes, look at this. Look at these people, they died a long time ago to me. Um, so yes, we are going to be creating some more graves because of course, you know, never in your lifetime will you be friends with everybody forever. You know, they're always going to die to you. So we are going to, uh, and it's perfect, it's, it's becoming nighttime. It's perfect because it's almost like a spooky graveyard. So this is the headstone, spot for the headstone, and this is the uh, grave itself. So the headstone looks like it's made out of stone slabs. Now, uh, the reason why I made it out of stone slabs, people are like, you could just use this or that. I made it like this because it should be generic, you know? You know how people can't afford it that much? Like, they could barely afford burying them um, instead of, you know, burning them. So they were like, um, you know, so it's about three deep. So we, at the third block down, we can put the, the uh, casket. And then, uh, <clears throat> yeah, the walls are made out of sand and stuff like that in that one. Uh, are they all made out of dirt, nicely? No. Okay, yeah, they all look like they're made out of dirt, but that's probably because that's where that is. I think there's sand behind this area. So, I think I'm just going to leave it ugly. I don't really care. And let me keep these materials on me instead of deleting them. I have a habit of deleting them, because I'm usually like, okay, I'm done with that material for now. Delete, and then, you know, start you know, a new thing. I, I always delete my hotbar. There's some people I see who do creative mode, and, like, they don't, like clear their shit at all they just completely keep it there and it's annoying all right let's actually start using let's edit this let's start using um uh oh god <laughs> oh my god i remember exactly why i put this bitch's casket in lava deep deep down compared to everybody else because i hated this bitch so fucking much oh well, i lost her top half of her body oh well the top half of her body's gone. Oh well, no one cared for her anyway. Um, stupid bitch. Uh, let's go ahead and block this back up. I'm dead. I know exactly why I did this. Because I hated her so goddamn much. I, I met her in theater back in school and she was just a total fucking bitch. So that's why she's dead. <clears throat> I think this one that I emptied out, can I, I can make her boyfriend. So... I forgot his name. I know it's just Derek, but I don't remember his last name. Huh. So let's see. The sign. I saw the sign and I opened it. Opened up my eyes. All right, I forgot. Yeah. I haven't listened to that song forever. All right. So we're gonna go ahead and make a body. This person is dead and deteriorated. And. That's it. Now we're gonna go like this and replace all the clay. I don't know why I put clay. I think coarse dirt looks a little bit more realistic because well, grass does grow back over where um somebody's buried, but like um I'd rather have a dirt. It looks more cool, you know. All right, there we go. And of course, this whole entire graveyard and cemetery is gonna have um it's gonna have people that I hate. Um, I do have a section for, like, my crushes that I had a crush on, and then, you know, they treated me like shit, so I'm like, okay, <laughs> you're dead to me, <laughs> you know, type deal. Uh, I also, I'm gonna have a family section, because my great-grandpa passed away, um, at the end of 2014, and, um, yeah, so that was sad for me, and uh, I'm gonna make him a nice, beautiful mausoleum made out of fucking perfect materials, and, uh, I'm gonna make it big enough for him, and then, uh, for my great-grandma, not to jinx or anything, but just, like, um, you know, in the future. I hope she doesn't die till like, 2200. Like, I hope we both live forever, because I love my great-grandma. She's so awesome. I love her so much. I was gonna say so freaking awesome, but I was like, eh, just awesome. No freaking. No freaking, because I don't want it to sound like fucking. Alright. So, I think, um... I can work more on this off-camera. I have a whole list of names. Um, 
let me just do two more people. Or, okay. So first, I know for sure we're going to do her boyfriend. Because he's dead to me because he's a little dickhead. Um, there we go. I don't remember his fucking last name, so I really don't give a fuck. And how do I put dates again? Oh, crap. Do I have to exit out? Damn it. Okay, so I put, like, the day, the year they were born, probably. I guess, sometimes. I just guess. I know they were a year older than me, so. 1997. And then I put the year that they kind of, like, died to me. Like, I just stopped talking to them, and I avoid them at all costs. I'm just like, you know what? Fuck you. Get out of my face. Before I beat your ass. Like, so, 1997 to 2000, and, uh, was it 14, I believe? Yeah. Because that's about the year that theater... Everybody was against each other, so, yeah. And I think these two open graves, well, we have three, but I think, I know exactly, let's start with two people I have on my list now. Here you are. We'll put the skull. I don't know why I put black skulls. I don't know why I put wither skulls. Maybe because it's like, it gets dirty after like a long, 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 long time. I don't know. It's been two years for some of these people in these gravestones. It's really been two years for in real life time. That's crazy. They died to me two years ago. That's crazy. Um, let's go ahead and do this. And I can't wait to make my family section. I'm gonna make it so big and so like grand, and so beautiful. It's gonna be so nice. I can't wait. But only obviously family members that died that I truly care about because. There's people who died, and my gra my um, grandparents are like, my my so and so cousin died, and I'm like, I never fucking heard of them before. <laughs> I'm sorry to sound mean, but I just never heard for them before. I've heard of them before, and I really don't care. <laughs> I never knew they existed. You guys just told me their name randomly. I was like, oh, okay. So we're gonna go ahead and put the other name here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Do do do. This graveyard is like perfectly spooky at night. Except it's snowy. I hate that it's snowy. I it shouldn't be snowy. I think she was born 1996, maybe? Or was it 94? If you're 90s if you're 98, you're 16 like me. Or no, 17. Um uh, So then minus three years. I mean four years. That's twenty. I mean, that's twenty-one. Yeah, so I think it's 1994. Alright, and I think I'll just leave that now, like that for now, and uh, we're going to go ahead and I want to start remodeling this graveyard a little bit, so let's go ahead and um, let's start making it a little bit more spooky, let's make it more like old and ominous looking, so let's go ahead and start adding mossy things to it, we're going to add vines, we're going to add, um, oh, I hate making trees in Minecraft if they're handmade, oh, I hate that. But it's, and, and I know builders are like, they would criticize me and be like, well, it's more beautiful. Why don't you just handcraft all your trees? Technically, I do kind of handcraft them halfway, but I make them look like the vanilla trees. Now, um, good builders would make their own trees from scratch, like how they want it to look. Uh, you change up the leaves and everything. I think, hold on. So let me finish this wall segment. I think I left a little dirt block. I was, I was confused as to why that dirt block was there. I was like, you know what? There was a pillar right there, so, yeah, right there. So, I'm going to go ahead and grab this again. Get this down. Oh, Doge. Look at the little Doge. The doggy. And there we go. So, there's a pillar every once in a while. Okay, I see. Um, We'll stop at that for now. Let me actually do that there, too. This wall. And then we'll make, like, a gate entrance to, like, come in. But I want it to be all spooky. I want it to be covered in vines. And I want it to be big and tall, kind of. Not really. I don't know. I don't know how I'm imagining it. And I want it to have like one of those old like metallic fences. But yeah, um, I would, I think for this graveyard I will handcraft some trees. I want to make it look like a willow tree kind of. So I'm going to look at some tutorials off camera um, over time. And I'm going to try to figure out how to do those. Look at that. Oh my god. Are they really chasing that skeleton? What? That's weird. He must have shot at them or something. I don't know. I don't know what provoked them to chase him. <clears throat> Let's actually set it to nighttime. I don't want any. I don't want everything to burn. I want to see this. I want to see them attack another skeleton eventually. All right, and I'll do this diagonal wall later. Let's go ahead and put a gate here. 
Um, let's put it over here near this area. Alright, so we're going to need, I believe I'm going to make it just out of these blocks. And uh, let's put it right here. About. Looks like that gravestone's kind of in the way a little bit, but that's okay. Step on it all you want. There are people I don't care about. And we're going to close it off. There we go. It's pretty basic. I don't care. And we're going to cover it in vines. And, um, I, I don't want a door. That's the thing. If there was a mossy door, then I would. But let's just do that. So it looks like one of those old-fashioned, like, fence gate doors. Oh! Uh. Oh! Oh, you hear them growling? Oh! Oh, they're vicious. Oh, you know what? I get it. Okay, so they changed the AI now. So that way they chase skeletons, I guess. But I get it because they're bones. You know, they want bones. Oh, jockey. I haven't seen a jockey strap in forever. No. Get him, Doge. Get him. Get him. No. Okay. Oh, I was going to say he's going to die. Oh, they're going after another one. I'm, this is so hilarious. <laughs> Freaking dogs. All right. Well, at least we know that they protect uh, villages now from skeletons. I don't know if I chase after zombies. Oh, look. Somebody come get the body. It's running away. The body's running away. <laughs> I'm dead. <laughs> That's funny. All right. Maybe it's because I left this grave open. <laughs> um, so let's go ahead and... um, Let's grab vines and just cover this thing up. All right. Here we are. And the college is right there. You see the red buildings over there? That's the college um, for the city. That's the university and um, University of Salem, I guess you could say. And I need to grow this faster. So let's see. Just a random block. That's funny that I chose ore block. That's weird. I just chose a random block. All right. And then we're going to go ahead and put it on the other side. <clears throat> Because I don't want to wait for this to grow. I want to see what it looks like already. So now we put... Oh, shoot. Damn it. How am I going to do this? Okay, so... Oh, I keep messing up. Go like this. Alright, let me just see what it looks like on one side. I'm experimenting here. I'm trying to figure this out. Okay, so it's overhanging now. Oh, crap. Oh, wow. That was a fail. <laughs> Let's put it on the inside. We can put it on the inside, too. Wow, it looks totally overgrown. That looks cool. Some builders may argue that, you know, that's too much, that's over-decorating, but I don't, I don't think so. <laughs> I think it's perfectly fine, because, you know, maybe it's been here for a hundred years, so it's going to be crusty. Anyways, guys, that's all we're going to do for today. I will do some off-camera, and uh, we'll change it up and make it look nice. And leave a like if you enjoyed this episode, subscribe today to become an elite and not miss out on any new content. And, um, goodbye, elites, goodbye.